हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम मार्गी पंचोली फ्रॉम आई टी एम यूनिवर्स फ्रॉम सी एस सी डिपार्टमेंट सेमिस्टर फोर हियर आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन द कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ कंस्ट्रक्टर एंड देर टाइप्स वॉट इज कंस्ट्रक्टर कंस्ट्रक्टर इज अ स्पेशल मेंबर फंक्शन दैट टेक्स द सेम नेम एज द क्लास नेम सिंटेक्स क्लास नेम विथ इट्स आर्ग्यूमेंट What is the use of constructor? The main use of constructor is to initialize object. The function of initialization is automatically carried out by the use of special member function called a constructor. The constructor is automatically called when object is created. There are several forms in which a constructor can its take, namely, default constructor, parameterized constructor, copy constructor. Default constructor. This constructor has no argument. Default constructor is also called as a argument, no argument constructor. For example, class is A and its constructor is also A. Parameterized constructors. A parameterized constructor is just a one that that has parameterized specified in it. We can pass the argument to constructor function. when objects are created the constructor that can take arguments are called parameterized constructor for example soon here copy constructor Co copy constructor is used to declare and initialize an object from another object for example would define the object c2 at the same time initialize it to the value of c1 the process to process of initializing through a copy constructor is known as copy initialization for example shown here default argument default argument is an argument to a function that a programmer is not required to specify C++ allow the programmer to specify default arguments that always have a value even if one is not specified when calling the function a programmer may call this function in two ways the first way value for the argument called c is specified as normal in the second one the argument is omitted and the default value of 1 2 will be used instead it possible to define constructors with default arguments thank you